And the search for Sean Christie took yet another turn today. The McAdoo man, who's been on the run since mid-June, posted to Facebook late last night, leading to another search near his home. The I-team's Andy Mahalchik is there right now. Andy, what's happening? Candace, we are in an area between Hazleton and McAdoo near the Schuylkill Luzerne County line. This is where federal, state, and local law enforcement have been searching for Christie since early this morning. This comes on the heels of a late night break in and that Facebook post. These images are all too familiar. Heavily armed U.S. Marshals, state troopers, and local police converging on a wooded area looking for Sean Christie. Investigators say Christie broke into Skitco Ironworks overnight and stole money, food, and a shotgun. The search comes just hours after someone posted on Sean Christie's Facebook page. At 11.52 p.m., the person, believed to be Christie, went on a rant against his critics and people he believes to be his enemies. We've blocked out the names of his targets. He also admits to breaking into Skipper Dipper's restaurant in Rush Township last week. He was spotted on surveillance video inside the restaurant, but denies being a dumpster diver. There have been reports he was taking food out of that dumpster. The Facebook post reads, I robbed the place. I never dumpster dived there. The post goes on to say, I don't make the rules. I'm just here to play the game. People who live in this area are not surprised that Christie turned to the Internet, despite being on the run for two and a half months. It's so easy to get cell phones or laptops or computers. It's not, you know, a hard, a hard thing to post on Facebook. Now, the U.S. Marshals are still not sure if indeed Sean Christie made that post, although indications are that he did. And if he gained access to the Internet inside Skitco Ironworks, a company spokesperson had no comment on that break-in. Also tonight, we have a web extra on PAHomepage.com, an interview with the U.S. Marshal that's leading the Sean Christie search effort. That's on PAHomepage.com. Reporting in Hazel Township, Luzerne County, Andy Mahal, Chicago Witness News. Andy, thank you. And a reminder to you, authorities do consider Christie to be armed and dangerous. If you see him, call 911 immediately. And coming up at 6 o'clock tonight, we're going to look more closely at how these repeated massive manhunts are affecting the community.